Hi, I'm Marcel Gladue, broker with Remax Crown, and welcome to another episode of What's Cooking in Real Estate. Today, you'll get to check out this awesome pad and learn to make a pad thai. So the first ingredients for a pad thai, uh, you'll need a fresh garlic clove. Cut this up real quick and come over here, add a bit of olive oil. And after you've added the garlic, we are going to add the chicken breast. Now this is uh, two chicken breasts, just nicely chopped. Now if you were a vegan and you didn't want to eat chicken or shrimps, because we're going to add chicken and shrimp to this uh, recipe, we're going to add about half of these shrimps, so that's about 15 to 20 shrimps. You could also add tofu. Now we're going to add one egg. And next we're going to add some um, bean sprouts and some carrots. And some, these are glass noodles. And these were boiled for about, uh, you just add them into boiling water and then you let them soak in cold water. So you just boil them for about three minutes and then you just put them in cold water. And we're gonna add a splash of fish sauce. Okay. All right. A bit of brown sugar. And we're gonna add a bit of soy sauce. And we're gonna mix it all up. And here, folks, we have a finished uh, pad thai. Now, this is one of our favorite meals. Actually, my kids enjoy this more than uh, spaghetti. And Tina and I had learned to cook this while visiting or traveling Thailand in 2012. We had taken a cooking class. So, so once it's done, uh, you can garnish it. We'll add a bit of lime juice, some fresh cilantro leaves, some scallions, and then some crushed peanuts and then if you like it spicy you could add some sriracha I don't like that much spice so I just added a, a bit just for flavoring and here we have it folks you have a fresh um, pad thai <laughs> 